Uh, Steve, I, uh, some people uh, say uh, Cruz has got somewhat of a mixed, uh, mixed uh, track record of view on, on immigration. I know he attempted to do certain things, uh, maybe go along to get along kind of stuff. Who do you think, uh, uh, really, and, and you know, are you in favor of this sort of strong I immigration policy? Well, for national security, you should know who's coming into the country. And uh, we've turned a blind eye on this for 30 years. We had needs in the economy. Would you export all the illegals? Would no, that's not going to happen. Uh, Donald's not going to be, Trump's not going to be able to make that happen. You're not going to take 11 million people, kids and that, put them on buses, uh, boxcars, and ship them to uh, Mexico. Not going to happen. The question is, what do you do about future immigration? And there, Donald Trump is beginning to sound a little liberal. He's saying, you know, we've got to reform the system. And that means a compromise. Ted Cruz knows in the Senate there are various things that have to be done. So in terms of the wall, yes, Trump will build the wall. We were talking before. It's going to be a beautiful wall. Probably have a golf course there and you know, <laughs> play around before we go. A little, go little, little gold leaf part. here and there. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, okay. but, uh, Mark, but, let me ask you. Who, who, I, I mean, I know you're, you're a Trump guy, no doubt about it. But uh, are, do you see any differences in their plans? And, 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 and who gives you the most confidence? I do see differences. You know, Ted Cruz has tried to move to the right of Trump on this issue belatedly. Trump has flipped on H-1B visas, and he's talked about flexibility. But, you know, if you take a look at the polls in, uh, from last night, in Mississippi, 50 percent of the voters supported deporting illegal uh, aliens, and in Michigan it was 40 percent. But you know, Charles, here's what I think matters the most is, what resonates is the simplest message, build the wall. Voters remember, for, as Steve pointed out, from 86, we got schnookered by the Democrats and the wall was never built. That's what people, that's what resonates with voters the most. So the reality is, regardless of what may be happened uh, in the differences here, people are turning to Trump because they believe he will do that. You know, on a parallel basis, right, if you look at the quick, Democrats, Mark, it's... But Mark, I'm sorry, we're running out of time. Will, will and you've got to give me a yes or no, will Donald Trump deport 11 to 15 million people? He will uh, definitely deport people. It won't be 11 million people. All right, guys, let's leave it.